Hi dears, in last class we completed the 13.2 exercise. Now we will move to the new exercise 13.3. In this exercise we are going to study about cone. Okay, curved surface area of cone is pi r l. Total surface area of cone equal to this curved surface area plus the uh, down we have one circle. You know that area is pi r square. So in this we have common pi and r. So I take it out pi r pi r means the balance is l plus r. So this is the total surface area formula. One more formula we have that is l. L means slanting height. Okay, slant. H is normal height, L is slant height, that is R square, square root of R square plus H square. Okay, now we will move to the example sums. Example 4 first. Example 4, see here, I am going to explain in book itself. Just listen here. Find the curved surface area of a right circular cone whose slant height is 10 cm. Slant height means this is L value and base radius is R 7 cm, that is L is 10 cm. The R is 7 cm. They are asking curved surface area. So, curved surface area equal to pi R L for pi 22 by 7 into for R 7 into 10 is cm. Okay. So, if we cancel means the 7 will be cancelled 22 into 10 to 220 cm square. This is the curved surface area of cylinder uh, sorry, sorry, cone. Okay. Now, fifth sum. See here. The height of your cone is 16 cm. They have the height that is H is 16 cm. Its base radius R is 12 cm. Okay, find the curved surface area and the total surface area of the cone. Use pi equal to 3.14. Okay, this one I will work out in note. Just listen, just listen here. The information I wrote here uh, curved surface area equal to pi r l. So we need l. So f r l l equal to square root of r square plus h square. This one we know. So square root of r square means 12 square h squared is 16 square so 12 squared we will get 144 plus r squared we will get 16 squared we will get 256 if we add we will get square root of 400 so the answer is 20. So root value is 20 okay so l value is 20 i am going to apply here for pi they told 3.14 into power r 12 into for l 20 we have to multiply and get the answer for curved surface area next one they are asking total surface area so total surface area formula we have um, this one for this formula i am going to use because the uh, this curved surface area we already know so pi r l plus pi r squared okay here you have to write whatever answer you are getting here. That answer you have to write here. Plus for this 1, 4 inch for R squared means hmm, 12 inch. 12. This simplification also homework for you. Simplify and get the answer for total surface area. Now I am going to move to the example 6. Example 6. A cone cup shaped somewhat like a cone cone cob abdina the muthu solla karad irukla idha solranga idha shape like a cone idha eppadi irukna cone mari iruk has the radius of its borders both and end is end as 2.1 cm the radius evlo kodutirukanga 2.1 cm so r oda value 2.1 and length that is height is 220 cm they gave the height that is h is 20 cm if each 1 cm square of the surface of the cob Carries an average of four grains. One centimeter circle, na, in the one centimeter circle, and the big circle, so three or more, and the sixty or more, that is, na, four grains, that is, much smaller, or more, that is, much more, that is, much more, four grains, so on, so on. Find how many grains you would find uh, on the entire block. Apo, in the four or more, that is, how many grains you would find on the entire block. Apo, in the four or more, that is, how many grains you would find on the entire block. Apo, in the four or more, that is, how many grains you would find on the entire block. Apo, in the four or more, that is, how many grains you would find on the entire block. Apo, in the four or more, that is, how many Multiply answer Now I am going to work out in note. This is the information they gave. We need the L value. So L equal to square root of R square plus H square. That is square root of 2.1 square plus 20 square. 2.1 means 21 into 21. So 1, 2, 2 4. 1, 4, 4. So 2 digit before that 4.41. Plus 20 square means 400. 
4.41. It is 404.41. So square root of 404.41. For this the answer is 20.11 centimeter. So now I am going to find the curved surface area. 22 by 7 into 2.1. L value is 20.11. So 1 3 is 0. 22 into 0 0.3 20.11 66 one digit before that into I'm going to multiply here 66012 so as well as 66012 6 12 to carry in one 7 2 3 four. so 1 2 3 digit before that so 132.726 centimeter square. So far, one centimeter squared we have four grains. So far, 132.726 equal to four into 132.726. I'm multiplying that actually 424 carrying two. 8 10 to 0 carry in 1 um 32 33 to 3 carry in 3 8 11 to 1 carry in 1 12 13 to 3 carry in 1 4 5 3 digit before 1 dot so approximately 531 531 grains we have in that one graph okay now that's all the exercise uh, example 6 is completed now we will move to the ex exercises 13.3 first sum diameter of the base of a cone is 10.5 cm that is d is 10.5 cm and its slant height is 10 cm that is l is 10 cm find its curved surface area see here d equal to 10.5 cm so as well as we need r value only so r equal to 10.5 divided by 2 okay 1 2 is 2 5 2 is 10 dot 4 2 2 is 4 again 1 0 if i add means 5 5.25 cm this is the r l value we need the curved surface area so curve formula of curved surface area is pi r so 22 by 7 into 5.25 into 10 if you simplify you will get the curved surface area this is the homework for you now i am going to move to the second sum see the second sum find the total surface area of cone if a slant height is height is 21 centimeter that is l equal to 21 centimeter diameter of its base is 2 meter that is d is 24 meter see here l equal to 21 meter d equal to 24 so r equal to 24 by 2 that is 12 meter they are asking total surface area the formula is pi r l plus r so pi value is 22 by 7 l value is sorry r value is 12 l value is 21 plus 12 so 22 by 7 into 12 into 21 that is 33 you have to simplify this this is uh, after this you will get the total surface area now i am going to move to the third sum third sum curved surface area of your cone is 308 centimeter square curved surface area is 308 centimeter square and its slant height is 14 centimeter find the radius of the base and total surface area of the cone radius r also we want to find out next total surface area also we want to find out see here l equal to 14 centimeter as well as r we want to find out total surface area equal to we want to find out. So, curved surface area equal to 308. Formula of curved surface pi r l equal to 308 centimeter square. For pi, 22 by 7. For r, we don't know. So, r into 40 equal to 308. 1, 7 is 7, 2. So, 22 into 2, 44. Into r we have. So, r equal to 308. So, r equal to 308 divided by 44. Cancelling here. 4 table. Uh, 1 4 is 4. No, 1 4 is 4. Okay. Um, so, 1 4 is 28. Carrying 7 4 is 28. 
वन लेवन इस लेवन तो आर इक्वल टू सेवन सेंटीमीटर फर्स्ट आंसर वी गॉट इट नेक्स्ट वी आर मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट वी वांट टू फाइंड आउट टोटल सरफेस एरिया सो टोटल सरफेस एरिया इक्वल टू पाइ आर एल प्लस pi r square this one i am using because this is the curved surface area value that why we have 308 okay i am going to use this here 308 plus 4 pi 22 by 7 for r 7 into 7 r square they gave so 7 into 7 17 is 7 17 is 7 so 308 plus 14 to 4 carrying 1 14 15 so i am going to add here 308 plus 154 12 2 carrying 1 6 Four. So four hundred and sixty-two centimeters squared. This only they are asking. Up to this thirteen point three two uh, three sums is completed. Now in next class we will move to the uh, fourth sum. Um, complete the homeworks. Okay. Thank you, dears.